Miel's Organics Babasu and Mint Deep Conditioner. Um, also, this is my first ever YouTube video, so yay. Um, so I will be doing a review, like I said, on this product that I have tried. Um, as you can see, the jar is empty. I got two tries out of this and I am very, like, disappointed, I guess, in so to speak um just because i wish it was just so much bigger i did like the product for the most part um the only thing i didn't like was the mint smell of it it was just very overpowering um as you'll see in the video that will be coming up of how i put it in my hair and i will i'll go over all of the deeds with that so stay tuned and yeah see you later bye Hey guys, so I'm coming back again with the Babasu and Mint Deep Conditioner from Myel Organics. And I will say again, I didn't like the mint smell, so I apologize because you're probably going to hear me say it one more time. Um, the consistency of it, I did love. It was a very creamy consistency, so it wasn't too thick or too light. I feel like it was just the perfect um, consistency for me. Um, so sliding it through my hair, I felt like it was a good coverage and good slippage um, for when your hair is damp. So it wasn't too much, but I felt that it held onto my hair good. It wasn't like too heavy on my hair. So as you can see, I'm just um, applying it through my hair, I'm, I'm finger detangling it as I am combing it through my hair. Um, again, I'm not doing a very good job, and as you can see, I am very clumsy with the product, but hey, it's wash day, we don't really care how messy it is, and it's an old t-shirt, so it's not a big deal. Um, so again, I'm just applying it into my hair, finger combing as I'm detangling my hair. Um, I did not do a good job this time around, so please forgive me. Um, but I am parting it, making sure that I'm getting as much as possible through my hair. Um, it's pretty decent, I will say. So yeah, so keep watching and I'll be back later. Hi guys so I'm back again I'm um, at this point I pretty much put all the product that I had left in my hair 
Um, as you see, I'm just massaging it into my scalp and just making sure that I'm getting out any noticeable kinks or knots in my hair as much as possible. Normally, I do do a better job at detangling my hair, so please don't kill me in the comment section about detangling my hair. I normally do a way better job than this, but for some reason today with recording, I just didn't do it, so please forgive me. So as you see, the product is in my hair. It has really good coverage for the amount of product that I had left in the container, but all in all, I'm very happy with how everything came out. So in this next video, um, it's just me sitting under my steamer for about 30, 35 minutes. Um, this steamer is from LCL Beauty, and I'll put the link below in the comment section if you guys are interested in buying um, from them. Again, this is not a sponsored video from anyone. Um, it's just me giving you my honest review on products that I've been using for my hair. Um, with this, um, whatever your preference is with either a hooded dryer or a steamer, uh, I would definitely suggest if you can invest in something like that, definitely try. But if not, I've seen other methods where people use um, plastic bags over their heads and it works just the same. Um, it's just your body heat giving off the steam and heating up your hair and you know warming it up and activating that conditioner into your hair. Um, so again, sitting under this for 30-35 minutes and then at the end of the video, I'll wash this out. And then yeah, I'll give you my final review of what I really think about the Maya Organic Deep Conditioner. Yeah, see you soon. Hey, so welcome back. Um, so I tried the Baba Sue and Mint Deep Conditioner by Maya Organics. Um, again, the only thing that I didn't like was that the jar was small. Um, I wish it was more because I did like the product on my hair. Um, the only other only thing that I really didn't like also was that um, it's a very strong smell, like very overpowering mint smell. Um, I love mint, but it's very overpowering. So even when I wash it out of my hair, I still have that mint smell in my hair, which I wouldn't mind it, but it's very overpowering. And when you're trying to sleep, all oh, that's all I smell. It's just the mint on my pillow and it's just a lot. That'll probably be the only thing that I really didn't like. As you can see, this is the end result of me using it on my hair. Um, I will say, I feel like my hair is well moisturized for the most part, as far as from my roots down to my ends but my ends per se i guess um they're still dry and i don't really know if that has anything to do with because i've been a month and a half doing my hair and trying to um relearn my hair i guess and know what it takes to you know, moisturize it well. Um, so I'm still in a learning process with that. Um, I, like I said, been trying products for a month and a half. Um, like I said, I also got two good uses out of this. I will definitely buy it again. Um, I don't know if this will be something that I will continue to keep using like every week or not um, because I'm still in the first phases of trying out different products on my hair. Um, and also just a very good point for this product is that it doesn't do any animal testing. With me being a vegan, um, I don't like to use any products that do animal testing or that has animal products in it. Um, so again, um, that's one thing. Also, um, I will be posting different videos. Um, so let me know if there's anything that you want me to try, any um, products that you want me to try. I'm open to suggestions because I am not a person or a YouTuber that knows it all, or claims to know it all. Um, if something works for you and you want me to try it out, please let me know. Again, um, this YouTube channel is really for me to hold myself accountable for my hair and just for me to try out different stuff, but also just to bring products to you guys. I know there's tons of YouTubers out there that are um, also doing that as well. 
um so yeah so if you know of any products that you want me to try let us just know and we'll see what we can do um and if you don't mind hitting that subscribe button thanks that would be awesome and greatly appreciated and the notification bell so that way you can know when i'm posting videos um so yeah so hopefully we will i'll be chatting with you guys again also leave any comments down below again if you want to see me try out anything if you have any suggestions on what i should do um to kind of like help my ends again um they are still dry in some parts of my hair i know it's one part like some strands of my hair my ends are fine but then on some strands they're still like very dry and i also know it's just a catching up game for my hair and it's just going to take time so again leave a comment any words of encouragement would greatly be appreciated because I am so nervous about this. So again, thanks and we'll chat soon. Bye.